So in today's video, I will be showing my One Piece card collection. Um, to get down to it, I am an anime person, anime fan. Uh, I am currently watching the sort of the MASH, like Burn Dead uh, series. I have watched the manga. Absolutely such a funny anime. It's literally one punch man in like a Harry Potter sort of setting essentially like wizards and all that uh, stuff um so oh hit my mic so i don't actually play the game i just collect the cards i don't even know how to play the game i even read the rules um i do have like a few like shiny shinies here as well um i just i will probably put the camera somewhere else just to so you can get guys can get so you can get a better look at them. Um, it might be actually best if I want to show what's in the book for the cards. I might actually have to move the camera. Or just hold the camera. <laughs> uh, so if I quickly... If I can actually do it with one hand. Uh, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, so I have what I've done is how I've ordered them is based on I think I've done that actually by the number if you can like see it down there. Um no 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 not by the not by that number I've I remember that I've or, organized it by by that, so I think the uh, the o. How do I explain this? It's what the card has come from the the packet from that from that series or from from that card booster pack. So you've got like booster packs that have uh, like op. Opo one and then Opo two and then Opo three and then so on and so forth or whatever um yeah so if i go if i go like right like at the quite far at the back so i've got one here that goes like opo3 um i don't know what it stands for I, i'll just have to find that in my own time um and then I've like organized it by number. So it's like one, two, and then three, four, and then five. I'm not doing a very good job of showing this, but oh well. Uh, and then six. And then so on and so forth. Uh, so some of these some of these characters I I can just remember off by heart. Uh, I did originally I think I started watching the One Piece anime. I know it was before COVID. Let's switch the camera around. So I know that I watched. I know I watched it before COVID, and then I had to like take a little bit of a break from it because it is over a thousand series. Here's a mess, um, and I was just like, I need to. I need to take a step from One Piece and then like get back, get back into it. Um, I keep looking at the screen, not the camera. And I, when I when I got back into it, because I left off on um, where did I leave off? It was like after the Fishman Island arc, but I like stopped and then. No, it was like, oh, I remember now. It was like before the, um, I think it was just before the Big Mum Island arc. And then I literally watched all that. <laughs> That's insane. Um, no. I keep, I keep, I'm so passionate about this. So I remember now, I remember now. It was the Dress Rosa arc. It was when, um... When Luffy was fighting, like uh, in the uh, Colosseum, and 
I think it was like what um, Frankie. I even remember the scene. It was Frankie, Usopp, and then um, Robin meeting. Um, I, don't, I can't remember the the little people. I forgot. I forgot what are they. They do have like a, a, specific, a specific name to. It. I've, I've forgotten the name. Um, and then I watched all of that. All of, uh, Dress for Rosa. The the battle between um, Luffy and. Uh, uh, Do Flamingo, which in terms of like just villain, uh, villainary, 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 <laughs> villainary, um, it was so he his character development and turn like going like turning into a villain or him just being like a total like dick essentially a complete arsehole and then like the plot twist of uh spoiler alert um the plot twist of like i should have already said this at the start but the plot twist of like um him being like his he is a rich uh he came from uh the um what are the what are they called the, the absolute Absolute like assholes. Um, I've got the name like how like, the government sort of bends a knee to them, and they're like all oh, descendants from God. I've got the fucking and Luffy like punched one of them. I've got totally forgotten the name. Um, yeah, like your Doflamingo is like a descendant from them, and that like threw me off a little bit. Um, and then I watched the, like, the Big Mama arc, um, now I'm actually currently up to, um, up to the fight of Luffy against, um, <sighs> how am I forgetting these names, they're so stupid, Kaido, 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 fucking Kaido, there you go. I was like, oh, I was strong with that for a second. Um, yeah, the, the, the animations and like the, like the whole like cartoonish like vibe to it, and just so fun to watch. I've never watched an anime scene so joyfully, if that's even a word. Um, so good. Um, so back to it. Uh, so. Some of these I do, yeah, I can even, they do actually do, um, so you've got the name and then you've got like basically where they're from or, or what arc or what pirate crew they're from. Um, so some of these, I, I don't know if I should like, um, not too sure if I, if I should be like, having these in here or not but I don't know um there is I mean this is this is my take on on some of the cards but some of the some of the art styles are like really good such as this one um such as Lady Toku, Toku. um I think you would pronounce that Kazuki. Kazuki Toku, Toku, Toku. Um, yeah, you've got like those ones, and then you've got like just downright like lazy ones that are just ripped from like like the scenes, like anime scenes. I mean, if I can find like a really good example of one. So just th these ones, I'm like, this is like, if it just feels like it's, it's been ripped off from, they've like screenshotted an anime sh uh, scene and then like, like stuck onto a card. I'm like, okay, you could have done it a little bit better. Um, and then you have like these ones, like really good. They're like the, just like art style. Um, I'm not too sure if I should like, At the minute, I am trying to save as much possible uh, money as possible because I have, you know, taken up like investing. Um, 
So I'm going to try and save my, my money as much as possible. So I'm not too sure. Should I buy? <laughs> should I buy more cards or should I hold off? But I, that's. I think that's me, sort of a me thing. I need to figure out. Um, I don't know what my last card in here is. Um, I have to go. I have to go right to. I do not remember him. I don't know where he came from. East Blue. Was he from... I think he's from the... Ali... The Alabaster arc. Maybe. Um, you've got good old Bon. I was just like... And my last card is actually like an attack uh, card. Um, Baz said, I don't really know how, how to play the card game. I'm probably just going to collect the cards as I have been. Um, and then if I show you like the shinies. Uh, so these ones, my back is absolutely killing me. Um, I am trying to count. Trying to do this with one hand. So you've got uh, Magellan uh, with his poison attack, and then you've got a good old Django <laughs> uh, with the hypnotism uh, when he like swings that pendulum thing. Um, you've got Kaya, 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 Kaya. I think that's how to pronounce it. Uh, Usopp's like love, sort of intro, uh, love interest. Um, I think you pronounce her name Kafi Kalifa Kalifa. I I think I seriously need to rewatch the whole series again if I don't know how to fucking pronounce them. Um, uh, you've got Zoro's uh, the three thousand wilds attack. Um, I absolutely in the. I think it was in the. Um, the Stampede uh, movie when he did that like um, when he split when he split that like meteor he was going up against um, what's the guy that like who has like the devil fruit of like gravity like one of the fucking strongest fruits ever um, and he brings like a meteor down and he just Zora's like yep I'll just cut that <laughs> Uh, if only he could fix his like directions. Um, uh, you've got Mister Three. I don't know. I don't know if um, Odors might show him again. Mister Three, probably not. Um, it has been a while since like the Impel Down like um, arc. I mean, I have like I have like watched it before. I did start watching it before um, uh, before COVID, so I don't know like the exact like time difference between each arc. But I know it's been going on for like what was it twenty five years, thirty years roughly. Um, uh, you've got the Judgment of Hell. That's like another Magellan attack. Uh, Little Sadi, Sadi. Um, man, I need to, I need to figure out how to pronounce these uh, fucking names. Um, I think she was, yeah, she was from Impel Down. You've got uh, Sengoku, uh, another awesome character um, who fought, uh, what's his name, Goldie Roger. Uh, you've got good old Rob Lucci. Pigeon Man. <laughs> um, very slick. Uh, you've got Polly. Polly. I actually... During the War 7 arc, I would probably he say he's probably would be one of my favourite characters. So I accidentally... Um, I accidentally just pressed the pause button. Uh, yeah, so Paulie's probably got to be one of my favourite characters during the uh, War 7 arc. Uh, you've got Nami, um, 
I don't know like how rare these cards are uh, or if they're worth anything. Um, but I did. I do have another friend who's um, into One Piece as much as me, um, and he said that this one is apparently quite worth it. So, not too sure. Um, uh, you've got Smoker. I haven't seen him for a while in the series, so I don't know if he's he's probably going to show up in like the Egghead arc. Probably, I mean, manga readers probably already know that. I don't know that. Uh, ma uh, masked, masked, uh, deuce, doors, deuce, deuce, uh, spade pirates. Can't remember who the spade pirates are. I have to look that up. Uh, the sh uh, Charlotte Pudding. Uh, her card is absolutely phenomenal. I love, I love this card. Like, just the the art style than anything. It just looks so good. Um. Marco, he's probably, in terms of, like, characters and, like, looks, not looks, but in terms of, like, Devil Fruits and just overall character, he's probably got to be one of my top ten favourite characters. And if I had to have a Devil Fruit from the One Piece world into real life, Marco, Marco, Marco's uh, Phoenix Devil Fruit... I would love to have that. That'd be fucking awesome. Uh, Izo. Um, currently, yeah, I'm currently watching the Wano arc. Uh, Charlotte uh, Smoothie. Uh, obviously, she's part of the Big Mom uh, crew. Uh, you've got Craig, uh, one of the many enemies that Luffy f uh, faced. Uh, before entering the Grand Line. Um, and then you've got the man himself, Monkey Doo Luffy. Um, and the point is out, I, I love this I love this card uh, as well. Uh, art style, not just because it's Luffy, it's just how how he's like start uh, how he's like standing like that and his pose. Absolutely uh, great great picture on that so there's that um and i think i think i might obviously do a video on like i'm still not too sure if i should like buy more cars but i have to be very careful because <laughs> i might get addicted to it and i might like waste all of my money on like one piece cards when i'm not sure what be saving it for investing um but then again, it's a passion. I love it, so I get to spend my money on whatever. So I might do like, um, like uh, those like unpacked, um, what are they called? Uh, those like when people set up the camera and they like uh, unpack um, the cards from the sash and like see what they've got and everything. So I might, I might do that. Um, uh, and I think that's really it. I mean, I, I just I love anime. I just I, uh, collecting the uh, collecting the cards. I do have like a few statues. If uh, I do want to get now, I do I do understand that um, why people like shit on like on these animes a little bit, but I like them. Um, Goth and Scar and Pop figure. But I want to get a Jujutsu Kaizen um, statue, especially um, Gojo and Zuki, uh, not Zuki Midora, uh, Yuji um, statues. And also, I want to get a Luffy statue. Um, I might also go for a. What's his face? Uh, main character from Demon Slayer. Oh, uh, what am I doing? I love anime, but I keep forgetting names. Um, or oh, because I'm like very really nervous on camera. Um, but that is that's really it. If you've enjoyed the video, good, great, and subscribe. 
if you want <laughs> and enjoy your day. See ya. Bye.